welcome to week seven of the 12 week plan for successful swimming in triathlon. Well, we're over halfway and we're about to start session 19. Session, session 19 is entitled Swimming with Speed and Assisted Sprints. As always, we start with a warm up and today's warm up is two 200 meter swims, front crawl with 15 seconds rest in between the two. Please build your speed over the two so you slowly but surely get your speed up to your triathlon race pace. We're then going to put our fins on and we're going to do a drill we haven't done before so I'm going to go to the computer and show you. We're going to do four times 50 on 115 and it's skull to swim by length. Sculling is something that is often overlooked in swimming but it does give you a great feel for the water. What we're trying to do in sculling is trying to keep our elbows high and our hands around. If you notice that's very much in the catch position and by sideways movement we're trying to create forward propulsion. Now that might sound counterintuitive so surely we have to push backwards create to create forwards propulsion. But no, it's exactly what an aeroplane does with its wing. We're trying to make our arm a wing. So we create low pressure over the top, high pressure underneath and it creates a lift which is exactly what an aeroplane does and how an aeroplane stays in the air. So, hands on the surface, they drop to make sure that you're in that catch position and you move sideways, slightly bending your hand out and in and out and in and out and in. And that will actually create forward propulsion from the front like this. You're slight, turning your hand, turning your hand just slightly so you create even more propulsion with that forearm and your hand and that will drive you forward and what you'll find is you'll get a lot of feeling from your forearm and your hands after you do that if you're doing it properly well for me I actually feel I'm really working that muscle there really working it going forward and backwards really hard you can do this with fins or you can do it better even with a pool boy. See how you get on. Okay after that we're actually going to keep our fins on and do two rounds of four one link sprints, that's 25 meters, on 35 seconds. We're then going to have a recovery in between those rounds of 150 on 1 minute 20 seconds. Remember you've got fins on for these so the speed you're going to go at is going to be incredibly fast. What we're trying to do is give you the feeling of speed over your body. As you feel that speed you'll know what it feels like and it's really useful to actually get that feeling of speed so you can try and replicate that when you actually swim. Alright so the feeling of speed is taken throughout this session and the main set we're going to do five times and it is one 100 meters on two minutes ten trying to hit your triathlon race pace. We then do a recovery 50 off 115, going into another 100 swim on 2 minutes, done faster than your triathlon race pace, and another recovery 50 on 115. So after each main swim of 100, you have that recovery. And that recovery should enable you to keep that pace up. Now it's really important that your triathlon race pace is actually hit, and really important that you go, that you go faster than that on the second 100. Only by swimming faster than your triathlon race pace will you eventually get that to be your triathlon race pace. Now these aren't flat out. What we want to do is you want to take two to three seconds off of your triathlon race pace and actually swim at that pace. You get to feel what it's like. Try and make each of those five 100s on two minutes the same pace if you can. And then you'll really get to feel what it feels like to swim at that faster pace. After all of that, of course, we have a cool down and we're doing 150 meters today to slowly but surely bring your heart rate back down and get you ready for normal life again. In all, session 19 has been a total of 2,500 meters. And although that might seem slightly less than you've done before, you've actually done a lot of it at a reasonably fast pace. Well done.